hello guys welcome back to tech project so guys in this video we are going to learn that how we can create the search bar with the help of python search bar means i am going to show you that how our search bar is look like the, here you can see that we have the enter the url here i am going to type welcome then click on the search tab then you will see it opens as a browser here and searching with welcome so we are going to create this with the help of python so without wasting your time let's start the video so guys now i'm on my chrome.py and if you want to create your new just simply click on file new file then you will be on the new page and give it a name as you want to give i'm simply going to cancel it and start our coding importing our first sub library which is from tk inter import star star and after that i'm going to import our second library port web browser and importing our third from tk inter tk import with its space between them port entry yes and after this library is installed then we need to create a variable root which is equal to capital t k this is for the initialization of the library and after that i am going to give the title for that i am writing root dot title with a bracket and in the commas we need to give the name of the title search tab and after that just simply create the function for searching for that i'm going to create def search with bracket enter the url which is equal to entry dot get with bracket entry is the variable we are going to create for the just wait for it and after that we need to give the web browser dot browser dot the open url url that's it came out from the function and just simply give the label label, label. we have the function here so give it a one or two it's one why well, it's giving the exclamation mark it's one one and give the call the label bracket and in the bracket we need to give the root comma the text in the root so text equals to with commas give the name and uh, the url came out from the commas and give the description about the font so I'm giving it here font. It's font. Just a second. F O T. Yeah. Font. And the description of the font is I'm giving it here in a bracket with straight. Came out with this commas. Thirty. Comma. In the comma gives bold. That's the description of the text and after that give the grid so for that i'm going to label one it's one dot grid in the bracket give row equals to zero comma column which is also equals to zero one equals to zero yeah and came out with that and create the variable which we have called it entry which is equal to now we need to give the a url entered here so for that i'm giving it a entry bracket root comma the width which is equal to 30 and came out with that entry dot grid 
with brackets and call raw which is equal to 0 comma column which is equal to 1 now just little bit down and creating the search button for that create variable button which is equal to capital B button that's the class and create bracket and in the bracket gives root comma text now the text in the button we are giving it here search came out with the commas and give command that our search button will do command which is equal to search and after that we need to give the button dot grid so for that button button dot grid with again bracket row equal to one comma column which is equal to two with comma now give the column spam which is equal to two comma pad y y which is also equal to 10 and came out with that and create the main loop for that create call a variable root dot main loop and close the brackets and that's it guys we have created a program for the search tab when i and why it's showing red wait wait here i write something wrong yeah now when i run this python program then you will see it gives the output of the search bar and also provide the thing that we want so when i run then you will see here we have the enter the url here and i am going to type tag projects and simply click on the search button we have created then you will see it opens the browser here i am not going to open it now uh, hope you guys like this video so make sure that you hit the like button subscribe and don't forget to hit the bell icon and if you have any query let me know in the comment section